Hi everyone, my name is Rimun. Hope you are doing well. In this video, I would like to talk about some golden tips regarding Redbubble SEO or how to make your designs in a better rank in search results on Redbubble.com. And these golden tips are very important for everyone who is working on Redbubble, whether he is a beginner or he has been working on Redbubble without satisfied sales. So please focus with me in this video and don't skip any part of it because I am sure this video has a great value for you. In addition, I will make this video more practical since I will apply these golden tips on some of my designs to make it more clear for you. And as support to me, I will appreciate if you like this video and subscribe now to my channel for more tips and tricks in making money online in many fields like print on demand, affiliate marketing and others. And now let's go together to my designs to explain how to rank your designs better in search results on redbubble.com. Okay, and I will take these designs, as you see, this one, sticker of a swimmer coat, find me at the pool, and this design, which is about yoga lifestyle, yoga and fox, yoga funny, okay? So the first tip today of Redbubble SEO for your designs on redbubble.com is when you are working on niches or sub niches or cross niches, you have to select the main keyword with less competition with less search results as you see here in this design you will find i have taken this main keyword of my design like swimmer coat swimmer coat which has less search results than most common keywords like swimming lover swimming and so on okay and this design as an example for yoga lifestyle and for sure this main keyword has less competition than many keywords like yoga lover uh, yoga namaste and so on okay so the first tip today in the bubble sale of your designs you have to select the main keyword with less crowding with less competition as possible as you can okay and the second tip today is the second part of your title of your design you have many options either you can put the second main keyword of your design like this one here's the design is about uh, yoga and fox don't give a fox so the second main keyword of this design yoga and fox yoga funny okay or you can put in the title in the second part of the title of your design you can put a common quote or a saying people are searching for like this one find me at the pool find me at the pool it is a common quote people are searching for on redbubble.com okay okay and the third option of the second part of the title of your design is going in depth for describing your design like is it pattern vintage landscape or which colors are in and so on and by the way if you want to know how to select the main keyword of your design just going to the home page of redbubble.com okay and here in the search bar you can type like yoga lover okay as an example and here you will find many suggestions of Redbubble like yoga pose, fitness quotes, funny yoga, yoga girl, yoga lovers, and so on. And here you can find the best keyword of your design with less competition, with less crowding, with less search results. Okay. And here you have known the first tip today of Redbubble SEO, which is about the title of your design. Okay. And the second tip today of Redbubble SEO is going to the tags okay as an example for this design you have to put the main keyword of your design as the first tag for your tags for this design i have selected this main keyword of swimmer quote and i have put it as a first tag in my tags as you see here swimmer quote and believe me it really works for the better rank for this main keyword okay swimmer quote okay okay and the tip number three today of bubble sale is you have to select strong and relevant tags for sure it is better for your rank and for your bubble sale when you select keywords which are about your design which are related to your design 
which describing your design okay and if an example like this design okay like these keywords yoga and the fox meditation funny yoga funny yoga sayings funny yoga quotes yogi stickers yoga lovers fox lover and so on okay it is all these keywords are related to your design that describe your design okay okay the tab number four which are about also for your tags is you have to make variation between long tail keyword and short tail keyword as you see the long tail keyword like funny yoga poses it is long tail keyword like this one funny yoga sayings okay and the short tail keyword like yogi sticker yogi okay and quotes or sayings or fox and so on you have to make variation between long tail keywords and short tail keywords okay and the tip number five today of red bubble seo which is about the description of your design okay and here in the description of your design is some coordinated sentences which are describing your design and contain some main keywords of it and a strong call to action for sure i have discussed before about that topic and how to write a professional description of your design without any effort and for free and you will find this video up here and below in the description box okay okay and step number six today is you have to promote your designs on social media because you have to know about the click through rate and its impact of the rank of your designs in search results which means when many people are clicking on your design or sell it red bubble algorithm consider your design is a highly demanded design so it puts it higher in search results and it increases its recommendation in its marketing campaigns okay okay so please you have to promote your designs on social media like pinterest in instagram twitter facebook and so on okay for more click through rates for better redbubble seo of your designs okay and the tip number seven today of redbubble seo is you have to make a lot of designs of your niche or your micro niche in other words try to dominate this niche or this sub niche by making a lot of different designs okay or you can make a full coverage with your cross niches i will give an example if you want to go through the big niche of yoga you can cross it with other niches like yoga nurses yoga coffee yoga reading and so on okay and you reach up the end of the video thank you for watching and if you have any question you can leave it in the comment section see you in the next video and good bye